face the world tag team champions. So. And I think only because of just the precedent of what we're dealing with. Again, it's very rare that you get a farewell tour from one of the goats in the game. I'm um, just because sometimes, you know, you deal with situations where goats end up having the, the, the end of their, their career be stifled by injuries and. On to our next match. Now that the Street Profits have um, earned themselves a number one contendership to face the WWE Tag Team Champions, the I believe it's in the, I should know this, uh, the Tortured Poet Society, that's Travis Kelsey and John Cena. Uh, the 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 EVPs the 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 young bucks have something to say because they recently beat um both both the street profits in a match not too long ago so um these boys have something to say and want to make sure they get this shit handled correctly and I think for this one, we're going to skip the entrance because I do believe I don't have an entrance for the Bucks <coughs> in there you go. Okay, but yeah. Uh, the Street Profits recently winning that triple threat tag match against Red Dragon and the New Bloodline. Uh, now I get a chance to face John Cena and Travis Kelsey. Uh, we are on the John Cena retirement tour. <coughs> so just like how Cena is retiring in real life, we're going to be retiring him in universe mode. Um, as it stands right now, if they hold the titles, the Tortured Poets Society, if they hold the titles, you know, after SummerSlam, they will be in the main event of Survivor Series. Uh, that will be um, their reward, at least John Cena's reward for again. Um, For, you know again being the greatest of all time and what what a what a way to kind of highlight that show and elevate that show by featuring the tag team champions featuring john cena himself excuse me so um i think i i think i determined because we do have two sets of tag titles on the men's side um what will end up happening here is loser men winner of the men's world tag league will face the will face John Cena and Travis Kelsey in the main event. And then the runners up will face the world tag team champions. So, And I think only because of just the precedent of what we're dealing with. Again, it's very rare that you get a farewell tour from one of the goats in the game. Um, just because sometimes, you know, you deal with situations where goats end up having the, the, the end of their, their career be stifled by injuries. And so while Steam is healthy, we want to make sure he's highlighted and appreciated. Fire in the building. Let's go, baby. And obviously, these these men have something to prove. Because again, if they drop, if they drop this match again to the Bucks, um, I do believe that their match 
at SummerSlam ends up turning into a triple threat. And that's, which again, is only fair to the Bucks, since the Bucks, you know, are coming, you know, back and making some noise. So, which is important. Champions, so champions, and number one contenders, you know, again, the bullseye's on you guys. So, oh, wow. Oh, bring his head off the champions when they want the smoke, they get the smoke. smoke. Well, Byron, we'll see how badly they want the smoke here tonight. You can't argue their oh, wow, overlook the team they're squaring off against. They've done their homework, they're coming into this fight as prepared as you can be. And the, they kind of a repeat of the first matchup. Oh, wow, another hit on Montez. There we go. Oh, what an insecurity. This is not good for Street Profits to start out. Not good. No bueno. And this is match two of four matches. What a nice pounce. Nice, nice, great use of your power. Just yeeting the fool. Yeeting him. Oh. Oh, nice strike combination. Oh. Nothing but blind rage. And the prophets definitely have that it factor, but it didn't mm. look like it mattered there. Yeah, he was going to go after Dawkins or uh, Montez Ford again. Knee driven right through the face and again. Still and again. Yikes. And with an onslaught. Oh, what a kick. What an elbow strike. Another elbow strike. Nice uppercut. All right, get forward in, get forward in, get the fresh tag member in. Perfect. Hey, he's looking a little bit better. Nice frog splash. Hitting it again, doubling up two time. We go three time. Oh, that's smart. Super kick. Then taking out that leg and then hitting it with a super kick himself. Nice single leg Boston Crab. Deep in there. Deep in there. But just the amount of time he was in that submission could be very nice counter. Can't, can't afford to lose that leg of yours because won't be able to use the super kick effectively. Nice, nice Hurricane Rana. It's clearly the end of days. Why do you say that? Oh, hell shit. I've lost parts five times. It's raining sideways with them. Oh, <laughs> the hell? You guys don't have a hurricane passing through? Jeez. Skip up. It's nuts because there's someone. I was in her stream yesterday uh, from Canada. They had a stream where she's like clearly a little bit, I mean, like an hour and a half, maybe two hours north of me. Nice drop kick. Uh, she has mentioned that she had a thing of storms roll through and she lost power a couple times. And, you know, we had storms out west roll by that didn't hit us. I'm not, I'm not sure. Oh, we got referees counting here. Toss back into the ring. Oh, was going for it. Got it scouted. What an elbow strike. Oh, 
Oh no. Ooh, what a unique maneuver. Oh, what a kick. What a kick to the face. He needs to find his way back yeah. Got to get back in here. Ah, uh, reset the count. Oh, he, he, he got he got greedy. He gets him with the counter. He got greedy. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Nice. There we go. Got that tag in. Nice scoop slam. Is that Shawn Michaels and Shawn Michaels? I mean, yeah, that's who their gimmick is based off of. The the Bucks. Matt and Nick Jackson, yeah. All they know is super kick. Like that is their that is their moose set moose set. They're like a it's like if Shawn Michaels had like a sperm baby and they were both twin brothers. And then all they knew was Degeneration X and NWO. Like that's that's the Bucks. Nice tag again. Like that that's the Young Bucks. They're the 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 uh, the executive vice presidents of AEW. Uh, they started that company up with Cody Rhodes when Cody went indie for a good stretch. So yeah, Cody Rhodes linked up with them. So a worse Hardy brother. I mean, yeah. They are considered, for in some circles, a really great tag team. They're just spot monkeys. Like that's 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 all their matches ever are. A nice abdominal stretch. Let's counter. Yeah. Like they're very spot monkey, spot heavy, you know, they're very gimmicky. And then for whatever reason, they have multiple five-star matches by Dave Meltzer because Dave Meltzer is their butt buddy. And Dave Meltzer has a huge bias <coughs> to what's actual nice. Nice splash again. Yeah, I think they they wrestled the Hardys in the Hardys last indie match before they went back to WWE, which that reign was meh. Blah. I love this move. Over shoulders. Bah. Good tag team move. Bobby Lashley plus J profits equals success. And he's going to throw his ass right back in there. Where are you going, sir? No, Matt's alive. No. Oh, Matt's alive. We, we would know if Matt's dead. Matt's married to a Puerto Rican. All she ever does is post shit on TikTok with him. <laughs> yeah. Like if you, if you could find his wife on TikTok, she's hilarious as shit. But yeah, he's he's kicking. He's still wrestling. I think he might be an AEW. Or he may be independent. I'm not sure. Jeff is Jeff is or Jeff is still around. Oh boy, nice slam into a frog splash. And he keeps his focus on an attack to that area. And the count stops short of two. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. I hate tag team matches. What a super kick. Someone just lost the tooth. What a super kick. Super kick party. I mean, Sting retired. Ooh, what a slap. What a bitch slap. Uh, Sting ap apparently retired this year and had a moment and then ended up appearing again. Yeah. I'm not sure if he's... He's not going to pull a Flair because Flair has retired three times over and Flair has almost died nine times since he's retired the first time. Nice. Like my buddy Uncle Jay went to that WrestleMania match in Florida where Shawn Michaels retired him and cried actual man tears because it was a moment. And then the idiot went to TNA and then made a mockery of himself and then went to Mexico and had a match with Hulk Hogan. 
and then was still kept wrestling and then i think it might have been in one weird in an indie promotion where he was wrestling and he had a heart attack on the side of the ring and almost died so flair just needs to just like it's 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 sad watching some of the greats that we know that we grew up um you know cuz the, the 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 worst thing that she would want to ever happen to them is for them to like you know again die in the ring from just trying to entertain us but like some greats don't go out on their own accord flair had that opportunity and fucked it up Hogan has had multiple opportunities doing it, but because but because Hulk Hogan's a egomaniac and only cares about himself, you know it's just I I don't I don't care for Hogan. I don't care for Terry Bell Bullet too. Like I don't care for the character of Hogan because fuck Hulk Hogan, and I don't care for the racist MAGA racist that Terry Bell Bullet is. Which is why like I think this scene this this next year for Cena. Kind of will make or break how I look at him as the great. You know, for someone to announce a fair work tour in WWE is unprecedented. That's that's some shit Kobe did before Kobe went away. You know, and it and I mean, great for them to kind of want to get that set up his nice Highland sidekick. You know, they're they're gonna do numbers that you know, Cena's gonna make a shit ton of money. WWE's gonna make a shit ton of money. You know, I just want to make, you know, I just, I don't want to, I don't want this being a huge stain on Cena's career. Oh my gosh, he's going to do a suicide dive. Oh, yes, he is. Okay, Dawkins. We, we, they, this is what we call, we want the smoke. Yeah. Yeah, and he's always, Cena has always been consistent. As much as you didn't want to like him because he was being force fed to you, he went out there and he performed and he gave it his all and he didn't shortchange us. And, and that's one thing that I appreciate. At, at no point in Cena's career was Cena like, oh, hey, like, I'm just going to pack it in and I'm just going to let my ego do this. Like, he's always done what's right for business. Nice spear. Like, you can't say the same thing for. Dwayne, you can't say that for Triple H. You can't even say that for Shawn Michaels to some degree because the shit Shawn Michaels got into earlier in his career. You know, I know the wrestling business is a selfish business, but like, damn, renting a car is a whole mess, bro. <laughs> well, don't get Enterprise. Yeah. Yeah. And even after this recent documentary about WrestleMania 40, it made me hate Dwayne even more. It was going to go float over DDT. I counted. What is up, Meek Mitz? What is up? Bro, we about to go 30 minutes in on the tag match. Because tag AI is still busted in this game. Which is why I'm not looking forward to this tag league tournament that we're doing in, in Green Bay. Yo, fuck, fuck Enterprise. Fuck what that company represents. Fuck Enterprise. These motherfuckers try to claim I owed them five hundred dollars after after getting you know after getting in an accident and rental and then paying the deductible to get another rental, paying that outright, so making sure that the balance is you know cleared out, and then them wanting to send me another five hundred dollar bill, and then when I asked, hey, what was up? They're like, oh no, we inputted the paperwork incorrectly, and having that being told on a recorded call, I was like, no, nah, fuck you guys. You you can you can ban me all you want, but you guys are dirty. Fuck you guys. I was gonna give you guys a G. There we go. What a 450 splash, and that is a negative. How many weeks away are you from this trip, bro? Uh -oh. he had it and what is up, Meek Mets? 
Two weeks? I thought you were later on in the season. I rebooked it twice, and both times I said, I, I thought you were like, I thought you were like another month away, home opener. Boy, what is up, Braden? Boy. Nice. Welcome in on the YouTube side. Okay, I, I listen. I think I remember you telling me you said that, and then because like my brain out there, dude. Do you really need restream? I'm not giving OBS money. Why? Do you have a problem with me using restream, or should I be using something better? So I am using restream. How are you going to tell me I need restream? I am using restream. Perilous position to be in right now. Oh God, cover here. Breaks the count. Getting dangerously close to ending it all there. Vicious, downright savage club right there. Hits to the core like that will render you useless. The springboard attack fails to land. Oh, my God. Surfboard leg breaker. Clean tag for his partner. On a leg drop, Bulldog. Just letting his opponent know who the real top guy is. Big kick. Knew what was coming there. There he goes, right into the corner. Oh, man. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Looks like he has his finger on the trigger now. Perched up top. Diving block. Blockbuster. Wait. Please, I love her. Oh my God, can you get me? Uh, listen, Darius, I just met you. I, I mean, hang out, relax. Like, I don't just give stuff to give stuff. I mean, I, I mean, not the people I don't know, but like, you mean show his region? <laughs> okay, so how would I do that? That's that's what I need to know. What would I? What bot do I need to add? Shot connects. I mean, Discord me. It's about to get worse. Look at these knee strikes. Bro, we really about to go 30 minutes on a on a tag match. What a Jesus Christ. Doc is with the reversal. I'll tell you on Facebook. Okay. Yeah. Between either you or Meek, yeah. I mean, maybe that'll make the 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 dual streams a lot more. I mean, it's it's literally anytime that I do the dual stream, unless Twitch is not working, it's either you guys or it's like a bunch of kids on YouTube, which again I don't mind. Abdominal stretch, right in front of his brother's face. Oh. Ooh. Uppercut. <laughs> but audio levels are all right, right? I, I know, Meek, you always yell at me about audio. Same with Smog. Bro, we about to have a five star match, bro, and it's in a it's a house show. Here he comes off the tag. That yeah, perfect. Okay. Grabbing a hold of the arm. Oh, an arm breaker into the cover. Oh. 
Oh, we start. Oh, we start my fantasy football league. On. Imagine this. We're do, we're doing our draft next Tuesday. That's it. Bro, with the one and a half time speed, bro. Oh, look at this raining right hands. Non-stop blows. We got another person busted open here. Great wherewithal on the counter. Scooped up and nice tilt to world. I was slam. Do you know what the over under is, Meek Mets, for that Eagles game? Whoa. Whoa there. What is up? Josel on YouTube. What's up? What's it? Oh, wow. We got three out of the four competitors. Just go into your settings. Okay, wait. Relay automatically forwarded message from each platform. Okay, sweet. There's a relay mode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a, it's a re, it's literally like a click of a button. <laughs> oh wait, it's over. Oh no. So hopefully, if anyone else from the YouTube side says anything, you'll see it. Can this match end? Can somebody just end this match? Nope, oh, teammate comes out. <laughs> this is what I am not a fan of in tag matches sometimes. Because. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, we went 30 minutes and it was a four and a half star match. It's not. <laughs>